All right, y'all, one box of ziti pasta or penne, whatever, whatever y'all want. We're gonna take some uh, cherry tomatoes. I dice these up. I'm gonna put them right here. All right. I have some diced up green pepper. Put that right there. Okay, y'all, now I have some, uh, some cubed ham, diced ham. So if y'all wanna like make your own ham and then cut it, go ahead. But guess what? I'm not doing that. That's a lot of work. You gotta make a ham and then like cut it up. That, that'll take like hours. All right. We have some pepperonis here. I, I got these mini pepperonis because I think they're cute, but use whatever you'd like. I'm gonna use this whole bag. Not this though. I don't think we should eat that. All right, we also have some white onion. All right, so I'm gonna put that right in here. We're just gonna do a little handful. All right, let's see. And then, uh, you know what? So y'all, I wanna tell y'all this. This recipe came to me from a little girl named Presley. Hi, Presley. So she sent me this recipe and she's like, I think you should try it. And I'm like, I'm going to, cause it looked real good. So Presley, thank you for sending me this recipe. I'm real excited to show y'all this uh, pasta dish. All right, so we're gonna move this to the side. Now I'm gonna bring in my big bowl. Here I have two and a half cups of water. All right, that's fun, right? Water in a bowl, yay. Now we're gonna do two and a half cups of milk. I'm using whole milk here. Y'all can use uh, whatever kind, but you know, I think whole milk is the best, right? Go big or go home. It's my motto in life. If you're gonna do something, do it all the way, right? Why, why wouldn't you? Okay, there's a little piece of cat hair in there. That's all right, though. <laughs> I know some of y'all ain't gonna be happy about that, but guess what? It's life. <laughs> all right, we're gonna take a two, this recipe says two tablespoons of cottage cheese. So, I, oh wow, okay. And it says to splash it everywhere. So I did that for sure. All right, um, now we have a uh, cream cheese, eight ounces. I'm gonna put that right on in. Okay, I'm making a big mess. Presley, did you think I was gonna make a big mess? I bet you did, because I always make a mess. Two eggs. Plop, plop, okay. Now, we're gonna do, uh, let's see, a little bit of uh, red pepper flakes. So let's see, about a teaspoon or so. That's a little more than a teaspoon, but that's all right. We're gonna do a little bit of uh, kosher salt, about a teaspoon. All right, and then we're gonna do some fresh herbs. I have some parsley here. And uh, we also gonna put a little green onion in here just cause you know what? I like green onion, y'all. Y'all know that though by now. All right, so now we're gonna take uh, our whisk and we're gonna mix this all together. I thought about using my trusty fork, but you know what y'all, for this one, I actually think the whisk is gonna be better. All right, cause we got some eggs in here. All right, this looks real pretty so far. All right, y'all, so y'all know uh, sometimes some of y'all send me recipes, and if I think uh, they look good or, or y'all are going to like them, then um, I make them. So, again, Presley and her mama sent me this about a week ago, so I decided I was going to try it because it looks real good. All right, and, and uh, yeah, we're using a few dishes here, but I like how you just put uh, the dry pasta in, and then you just kind of put everything together. All right, so once we have this mixed up pretty good, I think we do. My arm's hurting already. Is that... Y'all, does y'all want her? Uh -oh. I can't talk. Never mind. <laughs> All right, back here we go. All right, y'all. So what we're going to do here, we're just going to give this a little mix. All right, so we're going to mix all this together. The pasta. Remember, it's dry pasta, okay? And I put a little bit of olive oil on the bottom of the pan. So dry pasta, white onion, tomato. I was like, what else did I put in here? Sheesh. Uh, green pepper, ham. That's a big chunk of ham. And pepperoni. And I use those little baby pepperonis, but uh, y'all can use whatever you'd like, all right? So once we have everything kind of incorporated, I think that's good. I'm gonna flatten this out. And well, now I've got a cat hair in my eye. Man, where's the Okay, I, I gotta go to the bathroom. There's a cat hair in my eye, I feel it. Okay, y'all, now we're gonna take this, uh, this mixture and we're gonna pour it right on top of our pasta and vegetables. All right. Perfect, look at that. All right, we're gonna get this. It's the cottage cheese, I think. Yep, yeah, yeah. all right. All right, Presley, you know what, Presley? I'm excited to try this. It's a little more steps than I usually take, but you know what? I think this is gonna be real good. I like that there's vegetables in it, and I like that we just put everything in one, uh, right, right on in one, one pan. All right, y'all, so I have a piece of foil. I'm gonna grab that. We're gonna cover this with foil and put it in the oven at 350 for 40 minutes, and then we have one more easy step. All right, y'all. Man, this is heavy. I feel like I'm getting my workout here just like lifting these heavy pans. All right. So this, uh, I just took this out of the oven. This is the pasta that uh, Presley sent me. 
So here it is. All right, the noodles are done. Yep, they're done, they're soft. So now we have one more step before we eat, y'all, and I'm excited. So we're gonna top this. Uh, I have some mozzarella here. Um, the recipe said to use shredded, but I don't know about this, so I'm gonna use this this kind today, all right? So it's already sliced, which I like. So we're just gonna, we're gonna lay this uh, right on top of our pasta. And uh, yeah, we're gonna, use the, we're gonna use the whole thing. All right, we're gonna use the whole thing. I love cheese. And cheese loves me. D D D. <laughs> I was trying to think of something funny to say, but it didn't happen. All right. I'm trying to see how many slices we have here. Now my oven's about to go off. All right. Okay. I'm like, hurry up, Kristen. Hurry up. Hurry up and beat the clock. Because now it's going to be like beep, 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 beep. While I'm still doing this. Look, I got 30 seconds, y'all. All right. So I'm going to put this back in the oven on 350 until the cheese melts and starts to turn a little bit golden brown. And then we're gonna try this delicious pasta recipe that Presley sent us, y'all. I'm so excited. All right, y'all, look at this. So uh, we have this pasta dish. Remember my friend, my little friend Presley sent it to me. So Presley, we about to try it. We put that mozzarella cheese on top and let it get a little brown. Um, so we gonna try it. I took it out of the oven a while ago, but it's still pretty hot. So, oh, this cheese on top. Wow, it's like pretty. There we go, all right. Sorry, y'all, I'm being loud. All right, it's kind of like a lasagna-ish. Okay, let's see. Let's see how this is gonna look, y'all. I'm so excited. Okay, yeah, kind of, well, sort of like a lasagna. All right, look at that, y'all. Remember, we have our tomatoes, uh, our pepperoni, our ham, some other stuff, some cheese, pasta, I don't know, some other stuff. All right, let's try it. Green pepper, I can smell the green pepper. That's how I know, all right. Get some of this cheese. Cheese is the best part. I mean, I don't know, it's all the best part. Okay, Presley, I'm so excited to try your recipe. I bet it's gonna be so good, y'all. All right, it's gonna be real hot too. Let's see, make sure I have a, a small enough bite. Just kidding, it's huge. All right, y'all, here we go. Mmm, 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 mmm. Presley. Presley, this is so good. Y'all, y'all have to try Presley's recipe. It's so good. 